Next item on our agenda today is 40 decimal 02, order authorizing a sales order agreement with the election systems and software, order number 166-15. Mr. George. Are you sure you don't want to move this to the end of the agenda, just uh, you know. to keep our audience here and save the best for last, maybe? <laughs> uh, Mr. Chair. <laughs> Uh, in this case, Jackson County does need to update our current uh, vote tabulation equipment. <clears throat> the agreement will provide for the purchase, license, and maintenance of two high-speed digital image scanners in election software package. Uh, first, election on-site support and a trade-in allowance for our current equipment. Jackson County Local Contract Review Board Rules, uh, Section 1, Division 160, Sub E-14 does not require the use of a competitive bidding process when purchasing election equipment necessary to conduct elections. Uh, this company that we're entering into a contract with es and has provided excellent customer service in the past to Jackson County. Uh, the equipment has been certified through the Elections Assistance Communication uh, Commission, I'm sorry, as well as the State of Oregon. The confidence, as you can well imagine, in the elections process is of most importance conducting elections and having the necessary election equipment to perform these tasks is priority for the citizens of Jackson County, in this case the request coming from our county clerk as well. The term of the agreement is the date of delivery of ESS hardware and software through one year from the date of final signature with unlimited automatic annual renewals until the agreement is otherwise terminated in writing. It is a first year expense of $195,293. It is budgeted in the clerk's budget, and I do recommend your approval. Thank you. Uh, Chris, you're, you're here. And do you have a few words on the subject? Sure. Good morning, um, Commissioner, or Commissioner Bridenthal, uh, Commissioner Roberts, Commissioner Dyer, and Administrator Jordan, and County Council Joel Benton. I want to uh, thank Jim Williams, our Secretary of State's Office, um, State Elections Director, for being here today. They had some hearings uh, last night, and he decided to uh, come in to show support to Jackson County. Um, and I want to thank our board for being proactive in their approach uh, to providing election services to the citizens of Jackson County. As Administrator Jordan stated, that um, uh, providing new elections equipment will ensure accurate, timely election results for our citizens. Anytime equipment starts to age, hardware, software, um, the proactive approach would be best. And uh, so I do appreciate you all uh, giving your support to our program. And I appreciate that Jim is here to show his support to Jackson County as well. Any questions? No, I mean, just to see you. <laughs> you guys did great with the old equipment. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that's resilience of a county clerk's elections office. Okay. Hi. Questions for you. I know you're doing. I know you're uh, uh, doing the best with what you have there, but uh, certainly in need. And I know very well what happens when things start to age. So, <laughs> yeah, we all know. <laughs> Thank you. I don't know that. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Oh my, it's deteriorating. Yeah, right. right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Any questions, questions of the staff? <laughs> I will move to uh, adopt order number 166-15. I'll second that. Any discussion? Uh, I don't think the equipment's that old. Comparing that to me. Like he said, as he put his glasses on to read it, right? <laughs> <laughs> Things happen when you age. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yes. Yes, thank you. And, and for some reason, I just know that our audience is not going to leave us and the Mr. Williams for the, for the Secretary of State's office is going to sit here because you're really interested in our juvenile corrections program, right? I, 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 just, I just knew that. 